Glory to Skellige. again. Welcome to Maurice workshop channel and to another video. Skellige is small but very interesting and important faction of the Witcher world with their specific customs, culture and fashion. Both in armor, clothing and technology, we can feel the Nordic influence. It is in book descriptions and also in the game visuals. Maybe kind of combination of Scandinavia in the Viking era and Scottish Highlands with their Celtic culture. If you are more interested in this Skellige topic, leave us a comment and we will discuss gear of this faction in more detail. That's for an introduction and now for the main theme of this video. We already made several journeys in Nilfgaardian style, but it is not the only faction we are trying to present. It is definitely for us most advanced in the meaning of the gear. With Skellige we are just at the beginning, but nonetheless we set out for a trip. Our goal destination was Brdy, beautiful location near city of Příbram. We chose this location because it's pretty close from Prague and also the nature there, especially in the spring, looks totally like fields of art Skellig. We catched beautiful weather and just the right time. There were still bits of snow and ice, but also already some spring greens. Most of the terrain is combination of grasses and grey stones. So 100% Skellig feel. We started our journey uphill and it is not steep and there are good paths. In a sunny spot after rock stairs, we stopped for a short snack and then we continued to the highest point of Birdy, which is called Tok. We discovered something which looked like warrior's tomb, so we paid our respect. Gear-wise we tested a few things, classical bedroll and how actually easy it is to carry it, Skellige style helmets and different methods of packing. Pretty interesting and useful was to use just tighten up tunic as a backpack. It works pretty well and you don't need to carry any additional weight. In our next style Skellige tour we'll definitely try it again. After nice straight march we arrived to beautiful white plains covered with heather. In this time of year it was just brown but we will be back there in the summer when the plains will bloom with these beautiful little wild flowers. The main meal there was pretty simple, just cold, but still nice and filling. Some smoked meat and cheese, fish, hard egg and a little bit of meat. Then through the moor we headed far to find our journey back, downhill and back to the woods. The distance was in total about 17 kilometers, which is pretty nice for one day. We look forward to repeat some trip in Skellige style, next time probably with overnight sleep. Our gear needs improvement, especially by its visual appearance, but it's functional, lightweight and pretty sturdy. If you like this commented trip and you want to see more photos and videos from our journeys and also hear more tips for your own journeys, give us a like, subscribe and leave us a comment. See you next time, until then, glory to Skellige.